The Magic School Bus and the Butterfly Bunch. It's fun to be in Miss Frizzle's class. We never know what will happen. But we do know one thing. When we go on a class trip, we take the Magic School Bus. Today, we are starting something new. Class, what do you know about butterflies? Asked Miss Frizzle. Butterflies are beautiful. They are colorful. They are insects. Would you like to see a butterfly? Asks the Frizz. Let's take a trip. I love insect trips, don't you? No, they really bug me. We get on the bus. All at once, it starts to change. Now, it is a butterfly bus. Wow, the bus is a butterfly. We're fluttering around. So is my stomach. Class, we are at a butterfly garden, explains Miss Frizzle. It has many plants that butterflies like. Those butterflies love flowers. The butterflies lay eggs. When the eggs hatch, they will be caterpillars. Those eggs are so small. We got pretty small too. All at once, the bus door opens. We jump out. Luckily, we have parachutes. We're landing on leaves. We're turning into eggs. Happy hatching! Soon, we start to hatch. We are different kinds of caterpillars. We do not look the same, but we are all doing the same thing, eating. This leaf is yummy. My mom says to eat leafy greens. I don't think she means milkweed. Good thing we all have soft skins, says the frizz. They stretch as we grow bigger, like balloons. I can't stop eating. When a balloon gets too big, it bursts. Mm-mm. Uh-oh, I think I just burst. Class, we are molting, says the frizz. That's when a caterpillar sheds its skin. Our old skin falls off. A bigger skin is underneath. Now we can eat more! We keep eating. We keep molting. We keep growing. Then we molt for the last time. Now we have a hard shell. Everything is upside down. No, Arnold, we're upside down. We are cozy in our shells. We go to sleep. As we sleep, our bodies change. We go through our last change. When we come out, we are butterflies. Our wings are still wet. We cannot fly. Class, dry your wings by flapping. Then what will happen? We'll just wing it. I'm hungry again, says Wanda. How do butterflies eat their food? Ralphie asks. They drink it, the frizz answers. Look, the butterfly's mouth looks like a long tube. The tube works like a straw. The butterflies drink from flowers or rotting fruit. Can we have milkshakes instead? Watch out for that bird, calls Miss Frizzle. What? Arnold yells. Arnold is too far away, says Tim. He can't hear us. I don't want that bird to eat me. I can blend into this tree to hide. I can't hide. My colors are bright. Bright colors warn birds we taste bad. What about Arnold? He isn't bright and he doesn't blend in. 
I can't watch, Phoebe cries. Arnold, look out, we all yell. He sees the bird. He lands on a tree. The bird sees him. Oh no! The bird flies toward Arnold. Arnold opens his wings and the bird flies away. What happened? Arnold's wings have markings. They look like eyes. Just then, we hear a honk. We fly to the bus. The wings of a buckeye butterfly look like owl's eyes. The bird thought he was an owl. We are kids again. Miss Frizzle drives us back to school. Did you know that most birds are afraid of owls, Arnold? I know I was afraid of becoming bird food. That's a hoot! Back in the classroom, we draw pictures of our favorite butterflies. Butterflies go through a lot of changes. Miss Frizzle's dress changes too. That means another class trip is coming. Not again!